Are we here? We're here, you got one hour now. One hour? What yeah. camera? Canon R6 Mark II with a kid lens. Kid lens? No! See you in an hour. Are you sure we can do something? A street photography with a kid lens? I believe in you. It's impossible, <laughs> but let's try. All right. All right, good morning, good morning. Hope you're having a beautiful day. Welcome to Reykjavik in Iceland. Hopefully our battery is charged and we're ready for some street photography with the Canon R6 Mark II. Um, well, a flippy screen, which is going to be very helpful. Maybe I got overconfident. I don't have gloves. And um, what do we have here? Got a kit lens 24105 f4 7.1. Now apparently it's already dirty. So let's try to... Uh, how are we going to clean that? Oh, I've got gloves here. Cool. Oh, that made it worse. Okay. Okay, this looks good. This looks good. Okay, perfect. Wow, look at this church, guys. Okay, I think I think this is going to be fine. We've got a sunny day. Very high aperture at 4 to 7.1. I've never shot street photography with a lens like that. So, I don't even know if... I'm gonna be happy with anything I should, but I'm gonna try as hard as possible. And I put my gloves the wrong way. Ah, Iceland has been awesome, but not much street photography uh, where we were on the trip. So let's let's try it right now, okay? Let's let's get it started right here, right now. Boom. Okay, 24 shot. I kind of want to use those lines right here. See if we can do something a little different. Obviously, we'll get the full like into like straight on shot after but look at this Boop. there you go what do you guys think interesting let's try to clean that screen so you guys can see better okay you should you guys should be able to see a little better okay so canon canon i made a full video with my experience with the canon honestly it's definitely different from what i thought oh that's cool we're gonna have the sun right there uh, it's different from the Sony, but I wasn't completely lost if I'm very honest with you. I, I didn't feel like I was gonna miss anything. Oh, that's gonna be an interesting shot because there's so many tourists. Let's try to get it from here. Right there, maybe. If we can get a little bit of that sun flare, that would be even better. Let's see. Okay, we've got people walking in and out. This doesn't matter if you're shooting this at the high aperture, honestly, for this kind of shots. Let's even try to get a, a thing. Can't really see my own screen if it's so bright. Let's see if we can make this better. Maybe here. Screen viewfinder, screen brightness. Oh, we're already at the max. Okay. Oh, that's us for a portrait. Hi, sir. How are you? How are you? Good. Can I take a photo of you? I love yeah, the hat. Sure. Yeah? yeah? That's awesome. Nice. And beautiful. Oh, one sec, I made a mistake. Uh, I don't know how to use my camera anymore. There we go. Beautiful. I love it. One more. And beautiful. Yeah, Look at this. This is called raccoon. Uh, raccoon? Raccoon from North America. Oh, that's... I'm American. Oh, beautiful. And I manufacture these. Really? No yeah. way. Yeah, that's awesome. Amazing. I live in Chicago, so this is oh, helpful. You're from Chicago? I live there right now. Yeah, oh, yeah. You did. yeah. That's yeah. beautiful. So you're vacationing here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So Exploring, taking right. photos. That's nice. That's awesome. Take care. Best Thank you. you. Nice to meet you. you. I'm care. here. Okay, let's try to get another shot. <laughs> that was awesome. His his hat is absolutely a real vibe. Okay. Okay, cool. I think we, we have the most touristy shot possible. So let's try to get some context of tourism here. Oh, oh no worries. Thanks. The photo was actually good with you. Look. Yeah. Oh, good, good. <laughs> because I took the tourist shot yeah. and then I'm like, oh, let's take a photo of someone taking a photo. Oh, okay. <laughs> have a nice day. Wow, look at this, guys. We can see the mountains in the background of the street. It's gonna be awesome. Let's, let's try. Let's try to get a, a few shots. Wait, which way should... Yeah, let's try to go this way. I love the colors also of the buildings. I think, And we've got such a great weather. I think it's gonna pop really nicely. And I kind of wanted to do just one last here. Just minim minimalist composition type. 
if we can because we have a 105 kind of like tight shot on the church with the sun flare looks kind of funky but why not why not you know this is definitely i mean kit lenses oh man do you guys want a whole video on kit lens because i think it can be very interesting to talk about that um in like are they worth it or not i can make i'll make a video and just give you my experience because i've shot with it for like close to two weeks and there is bad things but i think there's also really good things about these so depending on the context and the situation you may actually want to look into it and get one so let's see if we can get a cool shot here that's f7.1 it is slightly distracting if i'm honest to to me at least that's interesting i don't know if you guys could tell but there was someone in the background inside the shop that had his head turned that looked really cool oh i love that little light like poking in so like we just need a, a subject walk in there and then that looks really epic even this works look if i if i manage to like kind of hide my arm from the sun argh, i keep getting in the shot my own shot here we go i mean we don't have anyone in the shot now but with the yellow house reflecting that's cute um yeah we just need someone sitting at a table that would be extremely cinematic with the direct light hitting in there look at this cute little house okay okay just like ambience f5 fine there we go just a little bit like that and maybe a little bit like this tighter no let's continue i don't know if that works that is cool like middle of the street shot i don't know if i got it oh not bad for a random like last second shot i think we have to find a better street that actually has direct view on the mountain because this like condo in the background is actually in my opinion in the way so we'll try to find a little better but look at this house it's so quint in a way oh and look at that light reflecting on the floor i don't know can you guys see i don't know what's up with the big point here there we go and action there we go let's see what else we can find art and craft nice Hey, that works. Wait, let me tighten up my composition here. Oh, I love that. I love that. I guess it is possible to do something. Let's see what we can do here with the guy in the shop. You see, like this is a this is pretty neat. If only he could like turn the head towards outside. Come on, turn your head, turn your head. Oh, that's better, that's better. There you go. That's better. This place is really clean looking. I'm really impressed. This is definitely different than Japan, but it, it reminds me of Japan because it's so clean. You know the street? Look, this is a pink little house. What? With all those colors? <laughs> it's a little bit of a dream for Wes Anderson. Anything here it's if you've seen the the little pov i did in um oh look at this little compo here with all the houses there we go yeah i was saying it looks uh in in, in iceland you have a lot of composition that kind of remind you of wes anderson movies you know and i found it really cool there you go oh no the car just went in Okay, let's try it without the car one sec and boom okay i don't know about that one i'm shooting backlit so it's losing a lot of contrast uh, and apparently i think i'm in one of the most touristy area here like this kind of the center of Reykjavik but look we've got 
this is so cool, all the shadows that we have everywhere. I think it works out really nicely. Uh, let's see what we can do here. Oh, it smells like bread. Wow, I want that. Yeah, this would be a great like F2.8 shot, but I think it's gonna work also with the with that. Let's see. We get a little reflection. Oh god, I, I missed the the hen grabbing something. Oh, now we've got bread. I'll try to get something to eat after. After I'm done shooting, but Joe is waiting for me, so I can't be too too long. That's cool. Let's see if we can have a, something else happen. All right. Well, let's continue and uh, yeah, all right this is fun guys i love it you know you just grab your camera your kit lens and, and just go there out there and start shooting you know doesn't matter if you have the best lens or not honestly it does not matter look at this you can do a lot with with just what you have you can do a lot trust me uh, and it's such i mean honestly it's slightly refreshing to shoot with a kit lens also for me at least because i'm always used to the like best lens and it's hard like to talk to some people sometimes because they're like yeah but you're always shooting with the best gear you know so how can you recommend anything i'm like you know what you're absolutely right let's try to shoot with different things you know and because i don't have a 2.8 with me i can't really play you know with like super shallow depth of field or anything uh, I, did, I thought it would look better, but it doesn't really. Wait, maybe this is cool. This reflection. Here we go. Uh, what do you guys think? Hmm. Maybe not like that. Maybe more like half reflection, half not reflection, like this. Or like maybe like two third reflection, one third not reflection. Doggy in the light. Yeah, that didn't work out too well. Oh, we're in the main street as well. Okay, oh, look at that over there. This like house is like popping through the rest. That's kind of cool. Let's see. How can we like really make it stand out? Maybe a little bit of edit, a few touches with a, with a presets and some local edits just to make it really pop. Okay, we can get a little bit of flare here, but oh, like dead on straight, straight compo like that. Oof. You almost need a 16 to get it right. And, um. There we go. Ooh, with no one? We're gonna have it with no one? Is someone walking out? Oh, this one works. I like this one. Okay, cool. Wait, can we get a reflection? Hey guys, you can see me now some cool oh maybe that reflection of this house right there this is just like it just adds a little differentness differentness new word differentness oops nope okay i'm not super used to canon yet in the sense that i don't know if i'm overexposing my photos how much i can uh, get back i mean i've done it and i've shot in low light and i've given you the review and and i think you can recover a little bit but I don't know how flexible I am, so I'd rather shoot exactly how I want it almost in uh, in edits, you know, rather than trying to be in between. Oh, this looks awesome too, look at this. Yeah, I mean, this is cool, but there's too many people in front. It's a little confusing. Let's see if we can get the dog in. Oh, the camera picked up the whole dog, you see? It's like interesting. But this is gonna be hard to make. Oh no, someone went in front. Yeah, it's gonna be hard to make a great, especially if you don't have the F2.8 to help on that one. I think this one works out with the lady walking. Yeah, I think this one is cool with her bag. Ooh, look at this thing. I mean, the light is so good right now, it's incredible that anything is gonna look good so the conclusion is if 
if you have a, a kit lens and it's sunny your life is going to be a lot easier oh find out gallery with the photography look at this get inspired before the trip we actually went here on the when we arrived and then we headed off in the mountains check out the full video with the full vlog of the adventures in iceland i think it was super interesting because it's so hyped up and so touristy nowadays that i almost didn't want to come if i'm honest okay let's start to take a photo of in front of us it's kind of a cool scene we've got cool light and then this is a funny sign hi how are you guys you're looking good in the sun look at this you're like <laughs> chilling in the sun that's awesome have a nice day <laughs> that's so cute let's try to get the shot i was talking about but ah uh, I don't know how it's gonna work. Let's let's try to just get this like funny blue house first. I almost think I, I want to get like some geometrical shapes on me. Let's see. I don't guarantee the result, but I guarantee I tried. Huh? And uh, doesn't. I mean, uh, I'll show you the photo, but it's, uh, I don't think it's a great photo. <laughs> For sure not. Remember, practice, practice, practice. All you're seeing is practice. This is how we practice, guys. Okay, we got the background. Looks good. Or if you're at 7.1, there's no way to avoid that. Um, so let's see if we can get something. Maybe crossing in the light over there would be great. I don't know if that's going to happen, if I'm honest. Oh, look at this. we will just capture that in the meantime. I mean... I don't know. I thought it would be cool. It's not that cool. If I'm honest. It doesn't look that great. But let's try maybe a little closer. Something I just do differently. I shoot differently when I have different gear. You see? Like this kind of shot I probably maybe wouldn't think about sometimes with different lenses. But here I have a little bit of range for, for, fo for focal length. And I know I'm at a high aperture. So I'll kind of think about my shots differently than if I had a shallow depth of field on all the shots. Again, train your mind, train your brain. And uh, if you want some help for that, again, you can just check the link in the description. There is the 30 day adventure to great photos. It's always available for you during the next session. Hi, how are you? Can I take a photo of you? Can I take a photo of you? It you has... look really good with the hat and the glasses. That's awesome. You come back a little closer in the light. A little more. There you go. The beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Nice. And with the background. Awesome. Thank you. Do you want to see? Nice. Beautiful okay. light, huh? Yeah. Good. You look great. Thank you. Thank you. Have a nice day. Same to you. Are you pro or just a yeah yeah I'm, uh, but i'm traveling in iceland now i'm just having fun here yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. okay and making a little video on youtube where i show how i take photos in uh, in reykjavik you know okay yeah i'm an actress you're an actress yes no way if you want to google me you yeah? can do that what's your name she is actor that's true yeah <laughs> that's awesome <laughs> what is your name you type your name i'll i'll check uh, when i'm famous, home even. ah thank you beautiful thank you no problem it was so funny that you were taking picture of me yeah do you want do you want to do an, one more where you just you forget about me you're just walking this way yeah okay from here to here it's just when you're crossing i'm trying to get a little bit of flare and, eh, love it that's awesome thank okay. you so much have a beautiful day yeah same to you bye, bye. That's so funny. I love that. It's not exactly the shot I had in mind with the light. I kind of wanted it a little more backlit, like sideways, but I don't want to disturb her, so uh, I'm not going to ask her 20 times to walk, honestly. But what I'm talking about is like walking the light, having the flare uh, tighter on the face, 
and uh, and and really getting that the 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 face with the glasses and all that to really pop out. I mean, this is a start of it, but I would have to have a different angle on it. I wasn't ready, she, but it's awesome. Famous actress. Who knew? I have a full surprise here in Iceland. Look at this light. Mm. Looks so good in camera, by the way, with Canon sometimes. I'm always like, oh, this looks great. And then you bring it in, in Lightroom and then you're like, yeah, no, I'm joking. I mean, it still looks great, but that's something I noticed that's different from uh, Sony. And Sony, I'm like, yeah, okay. Then I look at it on my laptop and I'm like, oh yeah, it's a cool shot. But then here it's like, wow, this is awesome. And then I bring it and I'm like, okay, I gotta do a little bit of work here because it's not the same. The JPEGs, I, I just li like look, Canon look straight off the camera, honestly. It's very contrasted, lots of colors, and that's kind of what I vibe in. This architecture is very interesting, to say the least. Look at this. I kind of... Uh, I was like kind of in my head, like slightly beating myself up for uh, not taking a better photo of the actress, if I'm honest. Because I was like, I think I could have done a lot better even just directing her and I didn't really direct too much I was like I was just looking at the photo I'm like ah I could have told her to like look a little bit to the side and like play a little more uh, but honestly it is what it is you know I can't overthink it but I, I kind of do in a way you know like so if you ever feel bad because you're like this was great as such a great photo opportunity and you didn't take it well you're not the only one uh, knowing what I can do what I did <laughs> I'm like what the heck Pierre what were you thinking? Literally, that's literally what I'm thinking now. I'm like, what was I thinking? I think this is better. Yeah, this is kind of funny. I kind of like that. That's that's cool. Uh, and if we get the brand in there, I don't know if it's gonna be as as interesting, but let's try. Yeah, fun. Wow. I mean, I love the architecture for photos here. It's so interesting. I mean, with direct light, I don't know about one. It's gray, but today is an extremely beautiful day for for that type of photography, especially with that lens. I, I feel almost no restriction <laughs> except for the portraits. Oh, no. ah! I'm still thinking about it. I'm like, come on, Pierre. And you know, guys, like if you ever meet like people and and maybe they're like famous or whatever, or like maybe they're used. No, it's not so much famous. Anyone who's used to be on screen or used to be, uh, you know, with with cameras and stuff, there's even more pressure for us as photographers to make them look good. You know, like to really bring out the best. And I don't think I did that. So yeah. That's okay. I'll have to survive with that one. It's okay. My career is not uh, gonna be in Iceland. <laughs> I'm joking. Wow. And look at that. Anywhere you point, it's like you can play with that. Wow. Like, can we have a group with just one person here? Just one person. And she is in the frame. Three, two, one. Tick. Okay. Start to get a cute shot. Yeah, that doesn't work with this camera. I mean, it doesn't work with this lens. It can work with this camera, but not with this lens. Three shadows. Here we go. The kid. Yeah, but there's so much information in the background. That was 7.1. See if we can get a shot here. It could be cool. I can't tell who, who it is, by the way, if you're ever wondering. I do take some shots of people sometimes, but I don't, I don't usually ask them if you can't tell who it is. Hey, sir, how are you? Great. Good. Uh, can I take a photo of you? I love the look. Yes, because I have a cigarette in my mouth and it's okay. What? Because I have a cigarette in my mouth and it's okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good. Beautiful. Yeah. And... Beautiful. And come uh, in the light a little bit more. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, beautiful. You know what you're doing now. Yeah. <laughs> I love that. Look a little bit towards the sun. Here you go. Yeah. That's awesome. Beautiful. That's cool. Can you send them the email? Yeah. What's your email? Uh, 
Yeah, you're going to write it down for me. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it's beautiful. I love it. Thank you guys. Have a nice day. Bye. This is one I, I really like to do sometimes. One like that F18. I, I wish I had the 518 Mechanon for those shots because that would have looked epic with cigarette and the light and all that. Would have been awesome. I mean, this doesn't look bad, but I, the thing is, you see this one, I had to go. I was trying to get a little tighter, like 3550, but I had. That means the aperture cranked up to f5.6. But that's why everyone should get a 50mm 1.8. It's the cheapest and best lens they can ever get. It, it is a lens that will change everything for you. If you've never shot with that, if you've always shot with kit lenses. Like these ones, oh my god, a 51.8 will make you go, wow, look at those portraits. <laughs> Straight a little shot here. And with no one now. Yeah, I think it's nicer with no one. It's just very graphic. Oh man, everything looks so good here. What is this sorcery? Oh, but look, the camera can't focus on the food because the reflection is so much stronger than this. That's kind of funny. This way. Oh, look, blue background someone walking by okay let's try to have just him in the shot oh no oh no people walking in people walking in no people no 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 my composition no come on come on move 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 move, move. someone move 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 sir no no oh my god no 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 come on was perfect no this is a great composition the subject was perfect this man walking was like awesome this is not the same now no this doesn't work no this no this is not the same uh, too bad sometimes it just happens and either you're lucky or it's just not meant to be it doesn't mean you're unlucky it's just not meant to be <laughs> There we go. Look at the quality of the light in here. Can we have like someone like sitting here? Please. I just want someone like right here sitting. Maybe like with the red dress or white dress actually, but not too white, you know, like that would be, oh, here we go. People walking in. But no, this is not the style I was going for, though. Look at this, this guy on the, the other side, it's cool. Oop, maybe this one? Like eating in the restaurant? You know, just like a little bit of a light right here. Can't see the other person, can see the food. It's kind of cool. Whew. What time is it? Uh oh, it's 1.30. Trey is waiting for me, but I think we really need to try this, guys. So I'm gonna get in there, get some of these, and uh, me, Joey, he'll be happy. Woo! Here we go, guys. Got some goodies for Jojo. Let's go meet him. And uh, hopefully, well, let me know what you think of the shot. I think it was a pretty fun session. I mean, definitely with that weather. Wow. So impressed. Like so many colors here. So cute. Right on time ish. Not really. Hey! hey how did it go? I survived. And look. Did you rob a bank? I brought you some goodies. Ooh. Smell it. Oh my god. Right? Ooh. Uh, this went pretty well with the kit lens. Yeah? Yeah. I, I think you guys can let us know what you think in the comments, but I think it works, especially with that weather. I ended up taking a photo of some famous actress from Iceland. Oh, really? She's like, yeah, I'm, a fa I'm an actress and stuff. She gave me her name. She's like, just Google it. And oh. someone walking in the street is like, she's really famous and stuff. Uh. But then I was like so bummed because I didn't take the, a good photo. Uh. And then I was like, oh, I should try again and stuff. And Maybe I didn't. Maybe she's I, in that Netflix show or something. Yeah, I had too much pressure because now that, you know, she's on yeah. soon. Anyway, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go.